welcome to java forum now i am going to show you how to install llvm 14 that is clang llvm 14 compiler on linux mint uh, 21 operating system so linux mint 21 uh, is using ubuntu 22.04 uh, repository so this is the command uh, to install uh, llvm 14 so llvm 14 is a uh, default uh, version llvm 14 is a default version uh, for ubuntu 22.04 so same thing for linux mint 21 also so here you can see that uh, after running this command it's asking for uh, confirmation some new packages will be installed and additional packages also will be installed so installation is started so make sure that you have fast uh, internet connection okay installation is completed llvm 14 uh, compiler is installed so clang tab key you can see a lot of uh, commands are there clang clang plus plus clang plus plus 14 clang 14 so both are pointing to same version that is llvm 14 compiler clang version and clang iphone 14 version gives uh, both uh, llvm uh, 14 compiler version So I already told that LLVM 14 is a default version. Say lang plus plus iPhone 14. Yes. Okay. Now what I am going to do? I am going to uh, run uh, C compile and run C and C plus plus. Okay. So this is my C program. So I am saving the file as welcome.c. So C program using stdio.h uh, header file and print the welcome message. Okay, now I am going to uh, create C program. So C program also. Uh, using io stream header, header file and prints the welcome message. So I am saving, the, saving it as hello.cpp. So now let us compile and run C and C++ program. clang welcome.c iphone o welcome. So output file is generated dot slash welcome. Yes, so Output is successfully printed. Clang plus plus hello dot cpv iphone o hello. Okay, you can see the fatal error. Io stream file not found. So what is the reason? So we need to fix this. So first, uh, we need to check any problem in source code. So source code, there is not a problem. Everything is fine. Now let me go to usr slash include directory. So here you can see the C++ folder is there. Let us go to that folder. C++ 11. I can able to see the file io stream is there. See here, io stream is there. Okay. So then, what else the problem? So under that x86 64 Linux GNU. So there are two folders, 11 and 12. So under uh, folder 11, I can able to see the file lib stdc++.a. Okay. So this was not found at uh, folder 12. Okay. So come back. On, yeah. Come back on folder. Go to 12. So in this uh, folder 12, 
I can see that uh, libstdc++.a file is not there. Which means that uh, LLVM 14 compiler uses this uh, libstdc++ library. So what I am doing, I am going to remove the directory called 12. So just I am uh, moving the directory 12 to 12 backup. Okay, now LLVM 14 compiler will take the uh, libraries under directory 11. Okay. So now what I am going to do, once again I am compile the C++ file. So now you can see that IO stream uh, is uh, loaded into the memory. You can see that. So successfully C++ file is compiled. Let us run the output file. Yes. So now we can able to run the C++ uh, program successfully. So what is the reason is update is not happened properly. That is the reason. So Linux Mint 21 update, that is uh, some files were missing during the uh, update. So that is the reason. So fix the uh, folder, okay, fix the folder. Uh, 